Hey ladies, so I'm, I'm going to talk about SyncShare today. So um, this is a platform, it's a scheduling platform that you can use and integrate for Facebook and Instagram. But I'm just going to talk about Facebook um, and how we can use it for our VIP groups and for our parties and how it can save you so much time um, and how you can share a folder in like less than 2.2 seconds. So. I am going to share my screen so that you can see what it looks like. So um, this is what the SyncShare platform looks like. As you see right down here, it says to start your 14 day free trial. Um, but I do have a code that you can get 30 days for free. And then after that, you do pay $10 a month. Um, but I'm telling you, it is so well worth it. Um, so don't um, like let that discourage you right away because if you can book extra parties because of this, it's probably worth it. So um, a couple of things that you need to know. Um, the first thing you need to know is that um, it works with Facebook and it has to be um, like SyncShare and Facebook have to kind of work together. So as you see here, if you look up to the side here, it says log in. The first time that you log in, I would recommend logging in with Facebook. I'm not gonna do it right now because I've already done it, but that's kind of like how they talk to each other. Also too, if you're gonna use SyncShare and these private groups, you do have to um, put it um, in your Facebook group. Um, and let me show you very quickly. Um, I'll go to our team page and if you see, and I believe you have to do this part on your desktop. I tried to do it on my phone earlier and I couldn't find it. So um, definitely look on your desktop first. So if you come down here onto the side, there's this thing called settings. Once you hit settings, um, this whole group comes up. If you go all the way down to the bottom, you can hit apps. So um, you go on to the little pencil and you can hit add apps here. And then on the search button, you can just hit sync share, you find it. It's probably not gonna be there for me because it's already, it's already there. Uh, but sync share will pop up and then what you're gonna do is just click on it um, and then it should do like another whole thing and it will say um, like add at the bottom, okay? so. Um, once that is there, you'll go down to the bottom and you can see it here if it's if it went on. So I have SyncShare and BeLive. So those are the two things that are in my group. Um, so you have to do that for every single group that you have. So if you have on like a VIP group, I would highly recommend that and then add it to every Facebook party that you have. Um, and it's, look how quick and easy that is. That was like super quick, fast, right? So now when we go into sync share, um, I am just going to log in with my email and password. Um, so I'm gonna hit log in and let me see. Let me get these people on here. Oh boy. Hey guys. Can you guys hear me? I hope you guys can hear me. So I kind of already started, sorry. I didn't see that you guys were waiting. Um, so I'm in the sync share. I just logged in. Let me log back out so that you guys can at least see it that are coming on here. Um, so here's the platform here. What you're gonna do is log in. And what I was saying is the first time that you log in, you wanna kind of log in with Facebook so that Facebook and SyncShare can talk to each other. But I'm just gonna log in here. Um, I've already said this stuff, but I'm gonna say it again because some people just clicked on. But SyncShare, it's a scheduling platform, guys. Um, I have a 30-day trial, so it's a special link. Otherwise, you only get 14 days. Um, and then after that, it's $10 a month, just so that you guys know, okay? Um, but it's really, really cool and it saves you so much time. 
So I use it for my VIP group and for all of my parties. So there's a couple of things here. Um, here, right here is to schedule a post and it will tell you if you hover over it. Um, this right here is my networks. So what um, groups I have, um, I'm just gonna mute you guys, okay? If you have a question, just unmute yourself, all right? So these are like my Facebook groups. So you have to add SyncShare. It's just an app underneath the settings in your Facebook, um, in your private Facebook groups. So um, I have a lot here, so don't, I've been using this for a really long time. Um, but you don't always have to see these though either, okay? Um, these, I haven't done the save time with text clips. I haven't done this yet. So uh, we're just gonna skip over that. And then here, I'm gonna click out of this. So you're gonna see that there's graphics here and then there's saved. You can actually see your history of the things that you've posted through SyncShare. So what I wanna show you, we're gonna just go over a few things here just so you guys can kind of look at the platform and see if you'd like it. Um, but I have a lot of things that are saved, as you can tell. And one of them is my Facebook parties. Um, so if you take a look at this, right? Here, is, I kind of did it off of Monica Arce's um, format, but instead of having um, just like a mock group on Facebook and like dragging and copying, what I did was I just spent a little bit of time and I got everything in to SyncShare. Um, so I did a kind of like a couple of copy and paste, but now that I have my Facebook party in here, now it's just here and I can just use it. And the coolest thing is, is that I can actually copy these folders so if I wanted to copy this whole entire thing and maybe switch out some things and put like a different theme on it, maybe like, you know, a wine night, a cocktail night, or, you know, Halloween's coming around. Um, but it's a great landing spot for your Facebook parties. I also have um, our new stylist launch party on here. So as you can tell, it says right, it says right here, 2020 new style launch party. Um, so I have my new stylist get on here and do the 30 day trial. Um, and then I'm going to show you something really cool. If you come over to this side here and you hit select all, um, and I come to these three dots, I forget what they call it on SyncShare. Um, I'm going to unshare it just so that you guys can see. So I selected all of them and you can tell because there's a little check mark here. And then if you click over on the side, it's a share folder. Um, you can write a little description, you know, new stylist. Um, I hit share and I, all I do is do copy link. So after I copy this link, I can paste it into like a Facebook messenger or whatever. And um, she opens it and this whole thing downloads for her. So it goes all of a sudden she has a, um, a folder. So all of these come into a folder. Now this is kind of like the master copy. So once she gets it, so I send it to her, she gets it. Now she can't edit this one. So what she needs to do is to make a copy of it. So um, what she's gonna do um, is she's gonna come over, let's see, I'm gonna come over to here. She'll come over to the three little slashes here. She's gonna hit select all. Um, and then what she's gonna do is hit copy and move. So there's 32 in total. Um, what she's gonna do is make a new folder. So um, I'll just do like, you know, launch party. Um, she's gonna hit copy. And then, um, what did I just call it? <laughs> launch party. Um, it'll, it'll show up on the side. What the heck did I just call it, guys? I can't even. I can't even remember. <laughs> um, but it makes it makes a copy for you. Um, and the coolest thing is, is that you can just keep on copying it um, and then just adding to it. But what I liked about it was that when I had like, so I have my Facebook parties here, I can click on this one here and I can edit whatever I want, right? So I'm not gonna, you know, this one's can this one says Wednesday, July 22nd. Um, what I can do is I come over to this side and say if I have two parties like, you know, scheduled in September and I want them to go out on the same date and do like the same thing, 
um, I can click on, you know, starting on the 17th, whatever time it's going to go out. And then here is the Facebook groups, right? So these are the ones that I have that are active that are in that network. So my network is over on this side. See where it says my networks. Um, let me go back here to show you something just really quick. So like with my networks, right, do you see? So not all of these are showing up in that little box because I don't want to see all of them. The ones that have the, the heart here are the ones that you're going to see. So if I deselect that, you're not going to see it anymore. Um, if I reselect one, um, it'll show up. So let me head back to here. So see how Lead Up Powerhouse Players are, is now in this Facebook group and that Lacey's one is gone, right? So um, I can click on the date, the time, what time, like what where you are in the world, Eastern time, West time, Central time. Um, and then you can just click where you want that post to go. And then what you're gonna do is hit schedule. So I'm going to hit schedule post. It's going to go back to the same group that, that I have here. Or if I want to see like, hey, where did, that, where did that post go? It's going to show up. This is kind of like your home page is what I would call it. Um, and you can see like, okay, this is going to be scheduled. Um, it has three pictures in it. Um, but these are all the things that are going to be going out. If I want to take a look and say, oh my God, I, you know what? I did something wrong. Let me edit. I can just go back in here and edit whatever I want to do. And then I can just hit schedule post and it'll come back. Or if you want to get rid of it, I'm just going to delete the post. Um, so like you can see here, I have some upcoming posts coming. So in my VIP group, I'm showcasing a nail fee. Every single morning, you can see 829, 829. I don't know why. Oh, I was showing somebody else this one. So I'm just going to get rid of this. Um, I'm going to delete this. But what is really cool is I could go in. So I had like nail fees for September, right? I can come in here and um, click on this one. I can write my description in here. And then um, I can have it go out. But what I wanted to show you guys is how you can batch and actually find different names. So, okay, let me go back. Sorry. All right. And Margaret, while yeah. you're here and you were just showing where you can see posts that are scheduled, yes. if you go to the bottom of your list right now, it says pending. And if you go and you, you click on that, you can see it in a calendar view or the view it's in right now. Right. How cool is that? Right. So just FYI. Yeah. And then they also have like the history down here of like everything that's been scheduled out, what day and what time. So that's pretty cool. You know what I mean? Cause then that way you can say to yourself like, Ooh, I already did that one in that group, especially like your VIP groups. Um, you might want to just like take a look to see where you posted it. Um, which is, I mean, I love the platform. I think it's amazing. And I don't even know half of what I'm doing on here, but I know like enough to kind of get by. Um, and Diane, was that you? Yeah, it was. Yeah. But definitely show them the batch post because that's the bit, that is <laughs> so that, cool. That's magical. <laughs> well, yes. The thing too is, I, did, you, did you try the find and replace button? Oh, the find and replace is also magical. <laughs> yes, right? So so you can click, like, I could click select all, or I could pick just, like, a few of them. It depends on what you want to do. So say if, like, I'm here and I'm clicking through, on um, because those are the posts that I'm pretty sure it has somebody's name on it, and it's not the name of the person in the next party. Um, so I clicked the ones that I wanted, or you can click all of them. I can select all of them. Um, and then you go to find and replace. And if you text the person, so I'm going to just put hostess in there and I'm going to replace it with, I don't know, Betsy, right? So I'm going to hit search and everywhere it says hostess. Now every single post, look it, it's going through every single post to make sure that it doesn't say hostess anywhere. Sorry, I'm scrolling. And you can do an update post. And when you do update post, it updates it for you. And you can actually do that with the party link as well, guys. 
How cool is that? So when you're making your template, you don't even have to do this. Welcome to the hostess's new ad addiction, right? You can do the person's name because then you can just do find and replace and change it. Same thing with your on um, the hostess link. All you have to do is place the last person, the last hostess's link in there and change it to the new one and it'll change everything in the party. I mean, that's pretty magical, don't you think? I do. <laughs> because that's a pain in the butt. Um, and then the batch post is kind of like the same thing. Let me, I'll take something different. So say it's like, okay, I made these for on um, the team page, right? So something like, you know, nail fees or something like that for your VIP group, or maybe something like motivational or whatever it may be. Um, I can take, um, I can take, you know, these guys here, these ones are all supposed to be going out on um, every Monday or every morning say, okay, so what are you going to do? You're going to do a batch post. Um, I can start it on Wednesday. It's going to go out at 7.20 in the a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, and then you get to decide when you want them to go out. So this is kind of cool when you want to do like, I like to do in my parties, I have my party start on Wednesday, but then I do like an hour party format. Sorry, I'm going to admit somebody in. Um, so I have posts going out every five minutes. So when I have my, um, sorry guys, I'm just going to mute you and then just unmute yourself. Okay. Um, so when I have like my hour format going, I click which ones I want and then I just batch those. So those are the party po posts that batch out. So I do it every five minutes. But say if I'm on my team page or my VIP group and I want these all to go out Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, um, I want them to go out at 7.20 in the morning. It's going to start on Wednesday um, and you can pick the hours in the day. So I'm going to do one day, apply the intervals. Now look at, see what it did? So it's going to batch all these posts to go out. So one's going to go out starting tomorrow at 7.20 a.m. And then this one's going to go out on the 10th at 7.20 a.m. And the 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th. So cool. How awesome is that? <laughs> and just make sure that you, you know, select which, which page it's going to. But I mean, that to me is like amazing. Um, because you can actually sit down for like an hour and like legit get a ton of stuff done, <laughs> a ton of stuff. Um, did I show you how to share a folder? I did, right? That was at the beginning. Um, you can make different folders. Um, oh, actually before I even do that, check this out. Um, in the graphics tab, these are all from SyncShare that you can use. So they have a ton of engagement posts. So you can look through this and say, Ooh, I'm going to do an engagement post, you know, three times a week in my VIP group. And I like this one here. So I'm going to pick this one. I'm going to write a description, you know, whatever. Da, 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 da. And it's going to go out on the 10th, you know, at this time in this group and I'm going to schedule it. You know what I mean? Schedule done. Um, so like you can actually decide, all right, I want, you know, three engagement posts going out and I want this going out at this day, but it's on, is there a, is there a cost? Yes, yeah, Guild. It's $10 a month, uh, but I have a link for a 30 day trial. So if you want that, I will, um, I'll post it. I wonder if I should post it in the event or maybe I'll just post it in the team page so that everybody has it. Um, but it's like purely magical. Um, and I really feel like you could actually do more parties having like this type of format than like the copying paste of having a mock nail bar party. Um, and two, I really like it and I, I can share this with you guys as well. Um, I like it for my new stylist because it's a great way for them to learn how to like schedule their own parties. But what I do is I have that um, new stylist launch party, which if you need that, I will absolutely share that with you, share that folder. But what I also did is after she had this launch party, 
she was like, okay, so now what do I do? And I'm like, well, you can copy this and use this um, as like a template for your, for like the other parties that you just booked. And you can add that add to this. Um, but also I said, you know, you can use it for your VIP group. You can um, have certain days posting certain things on certain days and she kind of wasn't getting it. So I created um, a new styles VIP group and this is what I did. Um, so she could understand it. Um, and I think you guys can understand it, right? So Monday, um, I gave her some ideas of what to post on Mondays, just in case she didn't want to post like what I had there. But I said on Mondays, you could do um, Manny Monday and you can just go and post these. So post this one for next Monday and this one for the Monday after, right? So I just gave her these and said, why don't you just schedule these, see if you like this format, and then you can just add to it. Um, so at least it gave her a little bit of an idea of what I meant by like, okay, on Monday, you wanna do your Manny Monday, Tuesday would be Tip Tuesday, Wednesday is an engagement, post Thursday, just do something fun. Friday, um, I don't know what I, whatever I have up here, Saturday samples, Sunday, I gave her an idea of like a business blessing post. And then what I did is I had one girl's night in party that she could use to schedule out for one of her nights. So now all of a sudden she already has like two weeks kind of all set for her VIP group so that now she can just concentrate on messaging people um, and get an idea of how we run this business. Does that make sense? Yep. <laughs> uh, the other thing is that this um, also, you can, it's, you can do it from your phone. There's an app on your phone. Um, so if you love just doing everything from your phone, you would just, um, let me show it to you guys. I don't know if you guys, I, I'm sharing my screen, so let me see. I'll stop. Okay, if you can see it right there. It just says sync share, and it's kind of like the same format. It's a, maybe like a little bit different, um, just because it's smaller, so it's a little bit more condensed, but pretty much the same. Um, like this is kind of your home screen. But like all in all, that's kind of, not that that's it, because the platform is like, there's so much within the platform. The cool thing is they have a ton of help. Um, so if you come here, they have a Facebook page and they have like, look at how to batch post, um, manage post schedules, they even have like networks where you can actually be in sync share up here and you can design something with um, Canva. So I could say, I'm gonna do a Facebook post. Canva is gonna pop up. This is actually my Canva. Um, and I can create a graphic, a post, and then publish it. Um, so that's kind of cool. Um, I still don't know what text clips are. I have to figure that out. I haven't gotten that far yet, but um, back to the help, there is so much support. It's ridiculous. Um, and the coolest thing I feel like is the support is like usually little clips. Um, they're kind of maybe like two to three minutes or one to three minutes, um, which isn't a lot, you know? Um, and they have a ton of like, look at a party script, a party theme, um, party setups. They, they have so much. I can go back, actually. If I go back here, I can show you what they mean. If you go to the graphics here, because this is all my saved stuff, uh, but they have uh, Facebook party theme bundles. So if, you know, especially for somebody who's new, like how would if somebody wants to have like a movie night for their, um, for their party because like they're looking into movies like this would be like really cool you could integrate this into your facebook party um all you have to do is um hit it and they you can schedule it for whatever time you want it to go out um no, i don't want to save it oops go back um trying to think of what else i can show you guys um 
let's see. They have even industry branded stuff. So I think they have nails. There it is. Nails. So they even have some color street stuff. So like this is kind of cool. Host a nail bar party. Ask me anything. You know. Um, buy three, get one free. So like I said, it's kind of really great for especially the new stylist that is out there. Um, but I actually love their engagement post and it makes it super easy. Also too, underneath your saved, like I love it for like my personal page, even though it does not post to your personal page, I will sit here and it's kind of like a place for my pictures to go. So if like I'm taking pictures and I'm like, oh, this would be a great picture for, you know, a business blasting type of thing. Um, I will put it in here and then that way when the picture is just in here, because like look at I've got some of these pictures are in here and you don't see anything written because I haven't thought of anything yet. But it's a place for them to go so that when I am thinking about what I want to post, I can just go in here and you know write whatever I want and I can keep it in there and then when I want to use it I usually go to my phone I can download the picture and just I just copy and paste it but then it's kind of like ready to go because I'm, I'm not one to do a business blessing post without putting like some thought into it so I'm you those are usually already done before the day that I'm actually posting it um so what questions do you guys have anything Bueller, Bueller. <laughs> I'm sure you guys have like a ton of questions. And if like you're interested in it, if you're interested in the platform, cause you're like, you know what, maybe this would help me. Um, I've been doing some like private coaching with it. Um, so we'll, like, you know, reach out to me because I, I have to be honest with you. I, I feel like it is like awesome. <laughs> it's such a powerful platform. Um, and there's just, there's, there's probably so much more on here that I'm not even using. You know what I mean? Um, let's see. Anyone? Yeah, I have a question. Yeah. So can you, can you post two parties at the same time? Yeah. Yeah. And it doesn't, cause I have post my party. Yes. But, and I did too at one time before, and then I got put in Facebook jail. Yeah. That's so what I didn't know how that would work with since share. Yeah. You know, I, um, I think I only use post my party like a couple of times and then people were getting in Facebook jail. So then I, I was like, oh, I'm going to get rid of it. Um, but everybody that ha who has used ThinkShare has not gone in Facebook jail. Okay. As I just said that. <laughs> Good to know. Crossing my fingers, but um, I've been using it for at least like six months. Michelle Albright's been using it for probably even a little bit longer. Um, and neither one of us have, we, we haven't gotten to jail yet. So okay. um, I don't know why. I can't guarantee that it's not gonna happen at some point. But um, so far, so good. And every once in a while, like, I might, like, not, um, like, not use the platform, you know what I mean, and go in and, like, schedule, like, a few of the posts, like, maybe just, like, uh, you know, my pre-party post I might not, but then I'll go in, the yeah. one that I'm doing, like, every five minutes, I'm like, oh, hell no. I'll just, you know, <laughs> I'll just go in and I'm like, no, I'm just you know, I'll do like my, my party post is what I kind of call them. Like I'll just click on them and I'll just do it every five minutes, you know? Um, and at least get those. Cause I mean, it, it does take a lot of time to schedule a party, you know? Yeah. And I feel like sometimes I was getting to be like, Oh, I got to schedule that party. You know what I mean? And now it's <laughs> like, Oh, this is like magical. And I, you can see, like, I think, do they do it on this one? I think I did it on some of them, maybe not. So it's part, like it says like party post number 12, party post number 11. It's kind of getting mixed up just a little bit because they keep on adding and changing some things. But, um, but the coolest thing is that it's yours. And two, like if you have a new stylist that pops on, you can share a folder in like two seconds, which you can't do that. Like you have to like, you know what I mean? You have to get all the posts together for them, which makes it a little bit more difficult. 
Um, so that's like another reason why I absolutely love it. And my new girls who have hopped on, the girls who are using Syncshare, they love it. Love it, love it, love it. Um, I like that they have their own templates too. Yeah. Because my party doesn't have anything. It's all comes from you. So they like the, what do you call it? The participation participation posts and all that yeah yeah so that would be great yeah and i mean they've got some like pretty cool like engagement posts on here like that are just kind of fun you know um and kind of a lot you know and they're always adding to it which is really really nice um and i just love like the different themes like i love themed parties and they have really good ones. Like we did that one for, um, oh God, that big party thing that we had for Christmas. We got everything from like here. We were just like, we're not re reinventing the wheel. We're just going to take it from here and post it, you know? So um, it's just, you know, like cool things, like some cool ideas, you know, just to like integrate. What is this one? Do. Yeah, no, I love it. Yeah, Diane, yeah, Diane, you've been using it for a little bit too, right? Yes, I used it for just two parties last month, and I have two parties this week, and I've scheduled everything through it, and it took less than an hour to do it all. And I changed the theme and the graphics and mm -hmm. all the things. Um, plus, I got my VIP scheduled too. In like yeah. an hour. Which I feel like that is awesome. Like scheduling out my VIP group like is huge. You know, um because I want it, I want a lot of stuff going out into my VIP group, but I don't um I don't want to spend like a ton of time in there. You know what I mean? But I should be spending a lot of time in there. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like I want to be like in the party scene and taking care of my VIPs, but I don't want to have so much time in there. Like I want to foster those relationships, but I shouldn't have to be like so invested in that. Um, and two, like, I don't know if you guys do like a girl's night in, but I try to do a girl's night in like every week. So I'll like be on the graphics page and I'll find something and I'm like, oh, this would be great. And I'll just download it and bring it into SyncShare. And I'll be like, well, I'll use that at a certain point and then I'll schedule that out. I mean, you could schedule your whole entire month out, you know, in a matter of a short period of time. Yeah. It, and it frees you up to create the relationships and mm -hmm. message personally. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Um, but I, and I know this was like a lot of information in a short period of time. Um, so, you know, if I have the, um, the 30 day trial, Yes, Gail, I'll give it to you. Um, and I'll put it, what I'll do is I'll put it on the team page. I'll just make a post. It'll say sync share and I'll have the 30 day trial on there. Um, and then, you know, you can use it for 30 days. If you like it, keep it. If you don't, then, you know, don't <laughs> just try to do the 30 days. Like if you have a party coming up, I would try to do it for that. And I can share on um, the new stylish training. Um, just make make sure you make a copy of it because the um, original is only you can only look at it you can't edit it so once I send it it'll come in a file just make sure that you come over here select all and then um, hit copy move and then you're just gonna have to do a new folder so make sure your new folder is something that you will remember <laughs> but um like I said I feel like it's a lifesaver for new stylists because now they have a party template ready to run my new girl signed on on a Tuesday I made her download this on Thursday we had a launch party on Friday she was bonus qualified in like a very short period before her kid even came <laughs> it was like wham bam thank you ma'am but you know what and it and it got her doing the work and I added her to the original uh, original graphics group and Anelfi group, and I said, now you can start adding to this template. Um, but I did have to get on a Zoom call like this with her and kind of walk her through it. But I'm telling you, it is like worth it. You know, just put a little bit of time in at the beginning to help them out, and then they'll they'll really kind of take it on.
but I just feel like this is an amazing um, format. So if you want it, you know, download it, get the 30 day trial. If you have questions, please ask me, just reach out to me. Um, I'm learning it too, but, but I kind of have a little bit more, you know, I'm getting the knowledge. <laughs> Margaret, one more thing that I just yeah. thought of is you can also, when you're doing that copy and move thing, mm -hmm. you can also hit select all in, in yeah. the folder and then you, well, for like a whole party and then you can yeah. drag it and drop it into a folder. Oh yeah, yeah, I saw that. So it's like, okay, so say I have this party here. I, I have to make a new party. I have this to make a new folder up. first. I don't know if you want to share your screen. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so here we are. So we have to make a new folder first though, right? Or yeah. No? Okay, so you make a new folder, right? Mm -hmm. New folder. Okay. And then I can take this, this party here, right? And then just yep. bring it down right? Yeah. You know what? I didn't do it that way. I went over okay. to all the posts and hit select all. Okay. So wait, you would have to go. I'm just taking anything guys. Select all and now bring it and drag it. So you go over to the posts. Okay. Here. Yep. And now drag. Drag all of that. Yeah. To over to the, the new folder. folder. Uh, yeah. new Click folder. on copy. All right, look at post type and copy to the new folder. Voila, look at that. Is that not crazy? <laughs> I mean, it's so easy. It's so easy, that's nuts. And then you can just delete the folder. Look at it, it's gone. <laughs> um, yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, I thought, that, I thought she did, she like dragged it. So I was watching some stuff today. Yeah, oh, I, can, I just got rid of it, but I thought you could take it and drag it, which I think you can, because what does that say? Yeah, copy. Yeah, it says copy. Yeah. You can probably do that, and then you can also drag one post and move it. So if I click... You don't want to have them all selected. No. I'll clear selection. Okay, so if I take this, oops, take this one, click it, and then add it to this one, you can just do copy. That's cool. Yeah, or you That's, can just put it in a different order in that folder. Yeah, and then I think you can just, you can just, move, can you just move these? Oh, no, these yeah. are, this is the original. That's the original one, though. I'd have to do this one. Yeah. You can kind of go like this. So, guys, I do, like, a lot of this stuff for, like, Instagram and stuff. Like, you know, people say, like, five things. So, I created, like, direct sales, Peloton, nails, biz, and family. And then, like, when I like the picture... I like, I put it in here and then I'll, I'll move stuff around. Cool. It's a way to keep yourself organized too. Someone saying something? I'm gonna go back. But how do you get this, how do you, how do you get this over to Facebook? So Gail, um, you have to, um, so can I do this in four minutes? So if I'm on Facebook, you have to go to, um, so I'm in Nail Republic right now. If you go to settings here, you go to apps, it's under advanced settings. You click on this little pencil, um, you hit add apps, and then you look for sync share and you add, you add it in there. Um, it, if I go to add apps, it won't be there because it's already there. But um, you can see where your apps are here. So SyncShare is now added to that group. And then when I go to SyncShare, um, let me get out of here. So if I go to SyncShare, what I recommend is when you're first going to log in, you should log in, log in with Facebook. Um, so that way they kind of talk to each other. And then um, and I'm gonna come back in, I'll log in and I'll show you if right here is your networks and you're gonna hit refresh and it's gonna take a few minutes and it's gonna collect all the networks that have SyncShare in there, like that have that app. So if you have it in like your VIP group and whatnot, 
So once you have all your uh, parties have sync share in it, then you want to go and um, you want to put like the little heart here it needs to be black so that when you're going to go and schedule, um, it comes into this right here. So these are your Facebook groups that you can schedule into. Um, clearly need to get rid of some of mine. <laughs> um, so that's how you get it to Facebook. Anybody else? So we got two more minutes left. Um, I will, <laughs> Susan, two more minutes. Um, but whoever doesn't have it, I will put the link for that 30 day trial. Um, I will upload this as soon as I can. I have to upload it to YouTube because the file will be too big. So it takes a little while. Um, but it's pretty awesome. Try it out. I would highly recommend it. Even if you don't have any parties going, I would try it for your VIP group. Um, and then, and then that will give you more time to message people to have parties. <laughs> um, but yeah, so if you have any questions, just reach out. It's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool platform. You can just play around too, you know? All right, ladies, we'll enjoy the rest of your Wednesday. Thank you, Margaret. You're welcome. Bye, Bye. guys.